the battlefield. Command posts. Players can use friendly command posts to change class or weapon loadout. Each time you interact with a friendly command post, your ammunition will be refilled automatically. Command posts also show how many players of each class are currently on your team. There are two types of command post. The first is found in the deployment area. This type of command post cannot be captured by the enemy and provides no team buffs. The second type is found on the battlefield and begins play uncontrolled by either faction. These command posts can be captured by either team and may change hands many times during a mission. A captured battlefield command post buffs either the health or supply meters of everyone on the controlling team. The controlling team is indicated on the command post screens. This is a security controlled command post. This one is controlled by the resistance and this one is yet to be captured. To capture a command post, a player must interact with it until the meter has filled. The more players that interact with the command post, the faster it will be captured. At higher ranks, operatives and engineers can buy abilities to upgrade a command post. You can only upgrade a captured command post. To apply the upgrade, the engineer or operative simply interacts as normal. While on the command post menu, they will see this meter. When it is filled, the command post has been upgraded. Turrets. Deployment areas are protected by indestructible and highly dangerous turret emplacements. If you approach the enemy's deployment area, you will be warned by your commander. If you ignore the warning, you are unlikely to survive the encounter. Deployable turrets become available to players as they rank up. Deployable turrets can be destroyed. Operatives in particular can purchase a variety of abilities for countering turrets. Mines. When an enemy engineer plants a mine, it is not visible to your team. Once stepped on, the mine does become visible, but will not detonate until the target has stepped off. If the target waits for an engineer, then the mine can be removed safely. Operatives can always see enemy mines. If an operative iron sights for a short time on a hidden mine, it becomes visible for his entire team and is marked on the radar. Once spotted, they can also be destroyed. Disguised operatives. Enemy operatives can disguise themselves as a member of your team, so you must be on the lookout for suspicious circumstances. The disguised operative will look exactly like his victim, but can only move, reload or spot mines while disguised. If he engages in any other action, his disguise is lost. So if you notice one of your teammates not engaging in combat, you might become suspicious. The only way to reveal a disguise is to incapacitate the suspected operative. But to attempt this, you run the risk of wasting bullets firing at your own teammate. To put on a disguise, an operative interacts with a dead enemy. He must be sure that no enemies are around when attempting this, or it will likely prove unsuccessful. 